today we will talk about creatinine so creatinine is a byproduct of a compound called creatine creatine is broken down when there is muscular activity such as exercise or just physical mobility and protein intake it could come from your beef and other sources of protein when you have increased muscular activity and protein intake there will be an increase in blood creatinine level however this should not cause you to worry because with a normal functioning kidneys it will just be urinated and when it is already urinated then your creatinine will just go down however when there is kidney damage creatine will not be urinated and your creatinine will rise in your bloodstream okay so what usually doctors tell us is to limit our muscular activity and limit our protein intake so that the creatinine will go down but actually it doesn't mean that your kidneys are already healing in fact you are actually just hiding the real problem wherein what we actually need to do is to improve our kidney function so that our body can just successfully eliminate your creatinine through your urine and so what are the things that we should do in order to protect our kidneys it is actually by knowing what are the main causes of kidney damage so our kidneys can get damaged with pain relievers such as non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs or what we also call ibuprofen methanamic acid all of those pain relievers usually over-the-counter pain relievers the next one would be hyperglycemia or too much sugar in the blood and that can come from your sugar fructose and starch and of course lastly it could be damaged due to hypertension and those hypertension can be damaged because of seed oils canola corn rice bran rapeseed sunflower oil soybean oil all of those vegetable oils except for coconut avocado olive tallow lard butter and ghee those are okay to be used but otherwise most seed oils especially margarine and shortening those are very toxic that can lead to inflammation and this inflammation the primary driver is actually still the insulin coming from this hyperglycemia so reducing your sugar into overall fructose and starch intake and of course your seed oil intake can improve your kidney function and when your kidneys are actually well you already don't have to worry with an elevated creatinine because with a properly functioning kidneys your creatinine even if it's increased even if you're taking proteins even if you're exercising this elevated creatinine will just be successfully urinated through your urine leaving your creatinine at normal level so i hope that's clear so creatinine elevation in the blood is not just because of too much protein intake but it's because of a poorly functioning kidney so primarily always remember to take care of your kidneys avoid intake of pain relievers and avoid inflammation in the first place always stay low carb so that we will all stay safe if you like this video and wish to learn more, I hope you can join our disease-specific 21-day LCF Masterclass.